Hey everyone, my name is Chris. I am the lead genius of South Shore BMW. Today we are in an X7 M50i, which is very cool. However, we're gonna focus on air suspension today. So air suspension is going to be available in our X models from the X5 all the way up to the X7. It is standard equipment in the X7. So it's gonna look the same depending on, it doesn't matter which model you get, the five, six, or seven. It's gonna look just like this. There's a little toggle switch. So I want to just explain a few things for you guys so you understand how this works. So by default, just like your driver experience control modes over there, the height of the vehicle is tied to the driving mode that you're in. So right now we're in comfort mode because that's the default every time you turn the car on. That's where it's going to go. If I go to sport, for example, you'll realize automatically that it is lowering itself because in order to have better driving dynamics, you want to have that lower center of gravity. So it's going to lower itself just like it did there. Now, if I press anything else like Eco Pro, Adaptive, Comfort, it's going to put itself right back to where it was up there. So that's pretty much the extent of the auto function where it's going to auto level itself based off of the driving mode. Anything else is going to be really based off of your preference and what's going on. So one thing to keep in mind though, so what I can do here is I can put this all the way down. I can keep pressing this and it shows you right on the iDrive screen as we're doing this, you know, real time, what exactly is happening. So it knows it has to get the lowest level, which is it's moving its way down there. So we're gonna wait till it goes all the way down there. So now in this X7, I feel honestly considerably lower than we were. It actually is a, a real thing. But as I drive around, let me see if I can try to show this to you. What's going to happen is you're going to feel that the vehicle is going to raise itself because it always wants to make sure that you have the proper driving dynamic. So I'm in reverse now, I'm in adaptive, so all that's okay. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna back up. And we're just gonna go in a circle here. And I haven't even gone, you know, two feet and automatically it is raising itself back up to where we started, which is going to be the comfort setting. So it did that because it's always trying to make sure that the comfort is you know, most important and wants to have those driving dynamics and it's not going to keep the vehicle that low. Now, if you are going to do rock climbing, climb over you know, something else, if I was going to go over here, Let's say, for example, and I wanted to start climbing over this stuff. This is an X7 M50, so please don't get excited. I'm not about to go do this right now on this uh, six-figure vehicle. But if I was going to be doing that, it would allow us to um, do that and keep it up raised, keep it down low. Whatever we need to do based off of the conditions, if we're going through rock, snow, ice, um, it doesn't really matter what we're doing. Um, that would allow us to do it because we're going to be doing it at such a slow rate of speed that it allowed that to happen. But some customers just like the, for the profile, have a very low look, like the vehicle is gonna be all close to the ground down there and it just looks really great. Well, unfortunately you can't just drive around just like that, just because that's your preference. Um, this is definitely a functional system that is going to work to help get you to, you know, achieve your obstacles and do the things that you're trying to do. So we're looking at gravel, we're looking at rocks, we're looking at sand, we're looking at all of those sorts of elements. That is what we're using the air suspension for. We're not really using it um, as just kind of a show where we're just gonna keep the vehicle down really low. So I think there, there needed to be a little bit more explanations um, initially when we launched the X7, because a lot of customers felt, oh, well, I can just drive around you know, and whatever uh, height that I want any time. And that's kind of not the case. It's always gonna self-level for comfort because this is an X7 at the end of the day and it's always gonna make sure that you are comfortable behind the wheel. So that's how that works. Called air suspension there, standard on the X7. It is an upgradable option on the X6 and X5. So please check that out if you do have any more questions with that. And uh, thanks for watching the video guys.